liturgically, the Christmas season ends this weekend with the Feast of the Baptism of our Lord. That may seem a strange ending to the Christmas season, but it's a feast that reminds us that God recognized His Son and that He truly is God made man. It also is the revelation of the Trinity, a reminder to all of us that God chose to dwell among us. Even though Christmas season is ended, the spirit of that season can never end, especially in Christ's name. You know, it's easy during these days of holidays to be generous, to reach out, to care for those in need. But sometimes when those Christmas trees are put away, so too is that spirit of helping other people. We can't let that happen in the spirit of our faith and in the name of Jesus Christ. The season of Christmas continues on, and we need to continue to watch out for those who are in need, for those who are hungry and poor, homeless and cold. There are too many in this world that are forgotten once those Christmas carols are stopped being sung. And so I hope we can continue to live the Christmas season in all that we do, mindful of the needs of others and of our responsibility to truly live the spirit in which Christ came to this world.